And a hundred years after Walt Disney founded his world-famous movie studio, the story of the village in Lincolnshire that he visited to trace his ancestors. Now, it's exactly a hundred years ago since Walt Disney founded his film studio, which has made some of the world's best-known movies. What's less well-known is Walt Disney's links to a small English village, Norton Disney in Lincolnshire, where his family originally come from and which Walt himself visited back in 1949 when he was tracing his ancestors. Here's our entertainment correspondent, Colin Patterson. A Disney fairy tale set in Lincolnshire. This home movie of Walt Disney visiting the village of Norton Disney in 1949 belongs to the Walt Disney Family Museum in San Francisco and has rarely been seen. The man who made Mickey Mouse was in the UK supervising the filming of Treasure Island when he took a holiday with his wife Lillian and their two daughters and went hunting for ancestors in Norton Disney. They were particularly fascinated by what they found in St. Peter's Church. You can see the three lions of Normandy. The crest is particularly significant because in 1965, Walt Disney wanted to commemorate the 10th anniversary of Disneyland. A coat of arms for Sleeping Beauty's castle was suggested, and Walt was asked if there was a Disney one. And he said, well, yes, I remember that crest. I saw it in Norton Disney in 1949 when I was in England. So they took photographs of it and they reproduced it on the castle at Disneyland in California. Since then, it is on every Disney castle in all Disney parks. And since 2006, that crest has been seen at the start of every single Disney film. At the top of the castle, you can see that flag and that flag comes from Norton Disney here in Lincolnshire. There is one person in Norton Disney who still remembers the Disney visit. And appropriately, they live on Disney Court. Hilda, now 94, was 20 when her brother Jim arrived in the pub with Walt Disney. I thought, who's that he's bringing in? You know, and then I thought, oh, he's not a bad looking man. So... <laughs> Anyway, they'd all come in with his daughters and they was chatty and that they played a game of darts. And more than 70 years later, it turns out that Norton Disney truly is Disneyland. Colin Patterson, BBC News, Lincolnshire. Right, let's see if there's a fairy tale with the uh, weather. Sarah Keith Lucas has got the latest forecast. <laughs> 